Hello everyone. This is C Morgan. Welcome to Twitchy Tuesday. We playing some DDO today, as per usual. Just wanted to point out this LFM first of all. And I uh, haven't let it mute the other side here. Mute the other computer. There we go. So yes, you too can be flagged for Defiler of the Just. Be flagged. I just thought that was amusing. I have a special guest star today, Lessa, who will be here shortly as I understand it. It's not really sure what we're doing today. Pretty sure we're in epics. Other than that, I would really like to do these oops, level 13s right here. We've got an arc, the Archon's Trial, Demon Assault, Devil's Details, and Defiler of the Just. Those would be really fun to be able to do today, but you know. Hey, Lessa, how's it going? Alrighty. Uh, is here. I guess I understand that, because that way you don't have all those emotes if you don't want them in your channel. Yeah, otherwise you could have all these emotes that you don't want in your channel. People spam them all the time. I was watching people earlier that got uh, banned for spamming other channels' emotes in the channel they were, I was watching. So, yeah. Looks like I still need to complete Monastery and Stealer of Souls. Hawks, Fod. Come on, skunk. Now I got a clear chat. But yes, exactly the thing I was thinking. Hey, Court Event, how's it going? So yeah, people have the U27 uh, raid up for group. That's fun. And I suppose I should turn party chat on. Titan, I already told you yesterday that special guest is special guest and you won't be joining. I don't know why you think you're going to be joining. There we go, that should be better. 
Yeah, there we go. Although, what is the push to talk key? Since I never use that. There we go, that's push to talk. Just a minute, folks. We're figuring out communications here. And of course, I have not used this in a while, so bear with me a minute and I will be uh, I need to turn off my keyboard while I do this. Here we go. Hey, board boat. Hey, virtual gib. How's it going?
Hello. Testing, testing. One, two, three. Hello. Yay! Finally, we can communicate properly. Because yep. I can hear you fine on the stream. Yeah, the delay <laughs> just gets annoying. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. I didn't even think about that whenever, uh, whenever we were thinking about uh, playing today. You have me till seven. Well, All right. seven Eastern. So let's say, so you have me for two hours, basically. Cool. So where are we going? Uh, I didn't even see what you're on as. Paladin. 28. 28. Mm -hmm. Aye, 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 aye. Let's do. House D. Okay. Going to spies in the house. I was going to start with black lock, but then spies. Yeah, that sounds fine. And then tide. Sure. You want to do the EEs or EHs? EHs. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> I never want to work that hard. But if you're on some kind of streak or something, I don't want to break it. No. Not at all. Do I need a rental cleric? Shouldn't. I bet you never roll around with one. Not I've never seen usually. you roll around with one. I used to. I haven't in quite a bit. There's my one and only buff. Oh, do I have that stupid... Oh, I probably have that stupid setting where it kills all the other sound when Skype's active. It's annoying. On the plus side, I don't hear your mimic, so... You know. I won't worry about it. I'll just get rid of him. I'll call Helmut. No, I mean, I can't hear him, so I don't care. Oh, does he? <laughs> I don't care. I cannot hear him. Yes, I have the auto clearing ED, so, or auto healing ED, so I don't really worry about ah. heals most of the time. And then I've got Cocoon if I really need. I get in trouble. And he didn't get tripped like he was supposed to. Hmm. Why did I just get Zombie Hunter? Hmm. Interesting. So what did you want to do when you asked to join? Is there something specific you want to do or just wanted to hang out and play? Sorry, new microphone, still getting used to it. Um, no, I just wanted to hang out and play for a little bit. Cool. This is the one stream that I get to watch with any kind of regularity. So, And I didn't think uh, your schedule would allow you to come and play with the damsels because we play so late at night. And plus, yeah. whenever we have a guest, they uh, they decided that they want if they want the guest, they want them the guest to be on the cast as well. So that's basically a two-day commitment. All right. Staying up way late. So I thought yeah. it would just be easier for me to come on your show. That's cool. Yeah, with the SO switching jobs and doesn't get home until like 11, I've been staying up later. But... There's a champion down there. Look at that. Is that what's pinging me? Yeah. Hey, buddy. There we go. I got him. Well, I didn't kill him yet, but it's only a matter of time. I knocked him out. 
Oh, he fell. That's so rude. Is he in a leash back? I hope not. I hope he doesn't. Yeah, he did, and he leashed back at full capacity. Of course he did. What a jerk. Yep. My stunning shield ability has uh, too significant a cooldown for me to use it right away. That's annoying. Those uh, leashing mobs, the only thing I don't like about them is they regain their full health. Got him. Other than that, I don't care, but regaining their full health is a little rude. Oh, I haven't even turned some of my abilities on. I forgot I've been playing in uh, Bard Destiny. Fate Singer. That's what. I should probably do some of that. I'm in Divine Crusader at the moment. I had maxed out. Uh, I'm trying to max out the Divine Sphere, so. Let's see. Yeah. I've already maxed out Exalted Angel and then Yielding Sentinel, so. Cool. This is my 11th life. Oh my god. So I just have Arcanes <laughs> left. So I'm in Fate Singer to. I've got, yeah, one Arcane so far, so I have two more Arcanes before I have Epic Completionist. But this isn't your home server, right? So that's pretty. Um, it actually kind of is. Oh, Barn Essen was my original home, and then I moved over here to play PD. And I've just been playing PD so long that uh, Thelanus became my home. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that. I have a guild that I inherited on Argon Essen, but um, I'm like the only person that plays in it. <laughs> yeah. And the only reason I play in it is because of the damsels, so... I... Wow. Do you play with the Warlocks much yet? Yeah, tried to be mean with me. <laughs> <laughs> Have you tried Warlocks yet? No, and I probably won't unless somebody convinces me that it's just this great, amazing thing and you have to have to do it. It mm. sounds kind of caster to me. It's, uh... Almost like a thrower build. I mean, that's kind of what they feel like if you use the blast. It's kind of like a thrower, but then you can buff yourself because you're a caster too. It's interesting. I went melee and have the uh, aura, and that's a little weird. I went half work and uh, maxed the... Uh, Strength and con, so I couldn't cast spells at first because I didn't have enough charisma. It's a little different. Our guild did a whole warlock party last week for our Thursday night. Things die fast when everybody's a warlock and shooting it.
These are much harder with dungeon scaling. And um, so many treasure bags. So Sorry, many. I'm eating an apple, so I keep turning my mic off. So yep. I can eat it. Um, yeah. It's like a Michael Jackson thriller video up in here. <laughs> Some meteors going, knock them all down. Helps it a bit. Oh, there we go. And there's always a straggler, too, usually somewhere in here. Yep, there's one. I'm trying to think what else I've done recently, did you? Oh, I got my crafting levels to 130 over the weekend with the bonus. Oh my god. That is awesome. I went from like 80-ish to 130. Then I got bored and stopped. Then I actually started cool. trying to craft something, some twink gear for one of my lower level characters and promptly ran into This is really a pain in the butt to do. Kenneth crafting well, what is What do you do at 130? I've never gotten any. Almost everything. <laughs> You can start doing the flexible stuff, so you can put things in the slots that they normally can't go in, which is nice. But Oh, I need this thing. Okay, I'll go make one of those shards. Oh, well, actually, I don't have the one unique component for that shard. Let me go get that. Oh, now i got to pass it back to my crafter through the bank, so I have to log into my crafter again. Okay, now my crafter has now he has to make a shard. Now put it in the bank. Now log to my other character. Put get in the bank and get it back out. It's a labor of love. Yeah, it'll be it. it'll be nice when the uh, shared bank crafting storage actually can craft from it. It'll save a lot of time <laughs> and effort. I'm really looking forward to that. But you know, having the at level five the invul invulnerability armor and all that stuff is going to be nice on my shiny new warlock. Hey, what's up, spirit caller? <laughs> Virtual good. Knocked him Got out. <laughs> bored halfway through the tutorial. That's, uh, yeah. It's a little bit exacting. I actually don't mind the leveling of the crafting levels too much, except that you know you do 50 at a time and you're done, um, as long as you have the essences stored up, which isn't that big a deal to do in between the uh, bonus weekends. But the actual crafting of items is just mind-numbingly boring and annoying to have to go, oh, now I need to go need to get this thing. Oh, now I need to go get that thing. Okay, now prepare the blank now. Oh, I forgot this. I gotta go back and get this. Blah. And you gotta take the things out of your bags. It's much easier to use the shards than it is to look them up in the 15 or 30 pages of stuff you can craft. It's just much easier to yeah. put the shard in there. This is the thing I'm trying to add to this. I use the. Uh, there's actually a crafting app for the iPhone. Yeah. It, so if I'm sitting or waiting for something, a board or whatever, I'll just pull it out. <laughs> try to make something yep it's on android too and there's also just the website you can go to and use and it's oh, yeah, nice to help plan them well. but then it's actually doing everything luckily i spent a lot of time deconstructing and passing all my essences over so I had essences to spare, and it wasn't a big deal to actually, oh, I need these specific essences. Didn't have to worry about that. Yeah. But then some of the unique things like Demon's Blood and Dragon's Blood and stuff, it's, oh, I have those, but they're on another character. And I don't have any purified fragments. I don't think on anybody.
but I'm happy to have made some stuff and at least learned what it's all about. Right here, sometimes you can get these guys in a state where they fall into the water and then leash continuously. Really? Oh, that sucks. It's really annoying. Especially if you're ranged. And I see I have my post processing on because I'm lagging really. Yeah. Poor. I'm, it's not just you. This is a popular area to lag, actually. Yeah, just turn your post processing off. It's really easy to fix. It's just. I either have it on and forget or leave it off and forget. I don't change it very often. Hello. Oh, almost time for Jerk to come down. For the big guy? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Come down here and die. There you are. Hey, Cordovan. Thanks. See you later. Hey! Jerry! Let's go see what crap loot's in the loot oh, room. Oh, that's right. We have to go open up yet another door to get treasure. It's probably not even worth it, but... Dang, I got three chests this time. Spies next. Yeah. Art seeds, thank you. I'll take that. Ah. Heart seeds. What? Good for you. Nutritious. Heart seeds. Oh, we're going spies. Aren't we? Spies is this way. Yeah, spies is yeah, right over here next to the chapel. I said spies, but I had my mind on tide turns. So. <laughs> Gotta remember, I'm on hard and have somebody else in here with me. Things don't die as quickly as I'm used to when I solo on normal. It'll be fine. It'll probably be fine.
It's usually not a big deal. Probably will remember getting gin out though for the electric floors. Oh. What? I'm allowed. You, is it okay if I kill these guys down here on the floor? Yeah, if you want to. Okay. Don't bother me if I have extra kills towards uh, <laughs> conquest. I just use my normal Zerg path. Yeah, these guys didn't even know you were here. I invised. Oh, okay. Got an invis cloak I used. Hey, Mary. Mary! Just that uh, I have. She's, I'm digging in my inventory. She's over here shooting at me. I have this new sword. I've been dying to try out. So I'm gonna try it out. Stop hitting me. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. He doesn't understand. <laughs> I didn't take deflect arrows this time, and I'm feeling it. <laughs> Normally I have deflect arrows, and I don't feel the archers as much, but uh, this time I didn't take it, and wow, it's a big difference. There we go. It works all right. Well, we appreciate you tuning in, Murray, even if it is only listening. I'm sure... Everybody's done these quests a hundred times, they don't really need to watch us do the quests, but it's fun to have people listening in and commenting and all that. So what quests haven't you done a hundred times? I have done several I haven't done several things ever at all. Okay. Tell me tell me one of those things. Hawks. What? Hand of Zoriat. Oh, right. Really? VOD. Vision of Destruction. Yeah. yeah, Lord of Blades. Haven't done that yet. There's several things I haven't raids. done. What about quests that you haven't done? There's only new level 13s I haven't done yet. Uh. <laughs> the U27 <laughs> ones that aren't out yet. Yeah, I haven't done those yet. <laughs> yeah. I was looking earlier. Let me look again. Let's see. I have, yeah, these four level 13s that are new. One's a raid, three quests. Devil's mm -hmm. Details, Demon Assault, Defiler of the Just, Archon's Trial. And then Stealer of Souls, Monastery of the Scorpion. Hound of Zoriat, Vision of Destruction, Lord of Blades. That's all I haven't done ever. And then I haven't done the Yugoloth uh, Shavarath ones on Elite on here yet. And like, I don't think I've done the Thunder Home raids on Elite yet. I usually don't do Storm Horns. Really? Stormhorns is fun, though. They're okay. I've done them a couple times. I'm trying to get up where you are. I just keep getting knocked down. I'll get there. Which is why I stopped and killed everything, because I knew that that was going <laughs> to happen. <laughs> it was just easier. Yeah. Well, I'll go get the optional one. 
the optional chest uh, breakables. So we'll get the full extra 10% for breakables. I have no knock, so I can't actually open the chest. Once more with feeling. <laughs> just not getting that jump up there. Uh yeah yeah just um trying to ah I'm trying to ride the air jets to where I'm supposed to ride them and it is uh I'd say at this moment the results are mixed. Are you training the all air jet route? Yeah. Like, like, I never do that. Another route. <laughs> yeah. I only need one air jet. The route I normally take. I find it a lot easier. I suppose I should wash my health a little bit. Let me open up this part and I'll come back. You've got Feather Fallen, right? Oh, yeah. Because it's possible without Feather Fall, it's just not as easy. Whoa! Oh, yeah, all these jerks I didn't kill. I forgot about them. <laughs> they went down the trap. That's funny. All right, let's find where you are. Messing with the wheel. I'll never mess with the wheel. Leave it on two from two from the right. Okay. That there one. There we go. Then come up here. All right, I, I'm on too high. You want to come up here? Oh. Okay, so let's pretend. Ah! And don't hit that air jet because it'll be back to the wheel. Don't do that. <laughs> let's pretend that I don't know how to get up where you are. How does one go about doing that? Just jump. Oh my god. This is so embarrassing. Here we go. The other thing you can do is you can jump from the top of this box here. It's a little trickier, but you're slightly higher if your jump is a little bit lower. And you just jump like this up here and turn. What is your jump at? I was going to say, what the hell is my jump? My jump is 27. That would be why. Mine's 42. See if I have a jump potion in my inventory. Do not. Does my jump clicky only work on myself? No, it works on other people. Really? I have a jump clicky that works on other people. <laughs> Did I just get jump? Yes! That should help a little bit. All right, so you stand here and you go here. Yep. Then you just jump across here and let the air jet take you straight up here. 
Yep, 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 yep. Jump cookie so valuable. Yeah. That's why I still have it on here just in case. Oh, hey. Ah! What's up, Skeleton? How you on? <laughs> Take feather fall back off. <laughs> Everybody's coming to play. They want to come see you. They were mad that I ran right by them earlier. Yeah. Twice. <laughs> they don't like being ignored. Oh, we last one rust treasure bag. I always be safe and jump that way first. Watch out for that jet. Yeah, because there's another jet there. <laughs> that one's random. Sometimes that one's on or not. Big thing with grease in it. Yep. With fire. Oh, that's awesome. Yep. Okay. Whoa, and electricity. Oh. Yep. This is this is all very normal. Just there walk through it all. As long as you have some sort of farm, it's not a big deal. Where's that last prisoner at? Haven't gotten there yet. Oh, okay. Sweet. So that... Behind us is the optional chest over there with the extra breakables. How do you get that? Um, what I usually do is I don't have wings or anything, so I just feather fall over to here. Mm -hmm. And here. And here. Then jump around till you get there. You can do it in fewer. I just sometimes don't have enough jump or speed to make it, so I always do the same thing. Chest is locked. Oh, I have a thing. Oh, all right. Chest is unlocked. Cool. <laughs> we didn't come all the way over here for no loot. <laughs> you better open the chest right now. Well, the, the thing, the valuable thing here is these four breakables because if you get those, then you can get the full ten percent on breakables. Oh, nice. So loot doesn't matter as much as the breakables to me. <laughs> it's just one more chest. It usually doesn't have anything good in it. And then of course there's that hidden. You know what the hidden does here, right? No. What the heck? Um, all right, I've got stuck key. There we go. So this hidden here, there's a lever. Um, I don't think I can see it. I don't think I have enough. Oh, I can. All right, cool. So if you open that, if you come back here, you'll notice there's now air jets. Mm-hmm. Which makes the ladder a real oh. pain in the butt to get up. Because oh. there's air jets there. What it's there for is you can be blown over to the other side. Instead of doing the jump, you need to be blown over. It's just annoying. But if you come back here and turn the lever, then you can turn those things off or on or something. The lever controls these being on or off, basically. Cool. So that's a way to troll people who are falling behind. <laughs> Then you get your loot here. Hello. Oh, I love it. And up here, it's possible if you have feather fall or wings or something, you can jump across here. If you can catch the air jet just right and it blows you across, which I did not do. But yeah. You can, one person, if it's more than one person, somebody can skip this whole part and then just start clearing the second half of it, which can be handy if you're going for speed. You still have to come this way to kill the necromancer and open the portcullis, but for speed, somebody can be working past that point. Champion water elemental. I wonder if the stunning shield works on her. Not especially.
The other breakables that people miss are over this way. If you see across there, there's a couple. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are easy to miss. Good catch. That was a waste of a meteor. Hello, pirate marine champion. Oh, how nice. A champion. Yeah. It's okay. Get the name. He's shooting at me, and he's not really doing anything at the moment. Hiding behind a pillar this champion. Rain is so much fun. I love having the extra lightning damage oh, at random. You stunned me. Oh, oh hey, Mist, respect. how's it going? <laughs> Good timing. Stop shooting at me. Have any monster chunks dropped yet? I haven't seen any, but I don't know. No, I are. haven't seen even one. Okay, this archer is getting annoying. There we go. Not badness, not bad. Hopefully, we can get the loot and lever now. Yep. So, that lever has to be pulled to complete. So, even if you skip this part, you have to come back and do it if you're solo. And these bookcases are breakable, so it's always good to get those for your extra XPs. <laughs> Which will give exactly. Or even worse, after he died, all of a sudden it goes, hey, by the way, that last hit when you killed him, yeah, we're going to do the meteor now. Where were you when I was surrounded by mobs? Stupid meteors. Or look, did you see that one? <laughs> it missed him. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Well, here, I'll give you a meteor that won't hit anyone. Hmm. Is this the part where Mephits try to kill us? Yeah, in that room there with the rest of the breakables there. Awesome. And a champion method. Oh, yeah. No chunks, though. Here's the last. Oh, yeah. It's going to say my voice is on. I'm ready. Back that was 10,000 XP. Yeah. This quest is awesome for XP. That's ridiculous. I mean, really good. That was ridiculously good. Yep. <laughs> Once you know this and can run it pretty quick, it's just... There's no reason not to run it. <laughs> oh, that's right. There's more fire lilies now. We don't have to kill them, right? We yes, we do. 
We have to kill them. But we unfortunately. do have to kill them. I find it's better just to sit back here and let them come to us. Okay. Unless you have good range. Uh, well, God. That's a good question. I don't have one queued up. Yeah, for melees, it's better to... Oh, is that a champion? I think it's a champion one. It is. Let's see if I can get his attention. Good. I left my returner in my other pants. Always keep a returning something. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know, I know the rules. And I'm breaking them. I broke rule number one, seven, five. That wasn't too bad. Let's see if we get the lucky bounce. Nope. No luck. around here and there's a couple more breakables up here to get. There's two boxes right here. And then over here there's a couple more. Yay. I'm going to use that shrine so I can get my Leon hands back. Watch for the so guys. Yeah, I was going to say it looked like there's some guys at the shrine. of spell points and stuff so no shrining <laughs> right. I can uh, buff though do that and that no to go oop 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 you weren't supposed to do that I didn't have uh, my feather fall on like I thought I did. That jump did not go well. Not go well at all. Come on, come on. No. Almost. Didn't quite get the lucky bounce. You can shoot straight up to the shrine from that air jet down there sometimes. Just go this way. And this ladder. Were you at cool. the top of the ladder? With friends. Yeah. No benefits. <laughs> These guys don't have heads, skin, nothing. Champion. There's a champion for you. It's another champion. Oh, you're not even gonna you're not even gonna fight him. <laughs> yeah, I just group him up usually. Oh. That way when my meteor does proc actually knock them all down. Oh, nice. And I like tripping the uh, caster first, too. Oh, I better put my lightning resist ring on just in case I pick wrong. Pick wrong. Yeah. <laughs> All sorts of champions. I still haven't seen any chunks drop. Nope. Then you know about the end here, not to cross the thing, but range the last two boxes. Oh. You don't? Okay. I'm just going to not pass you and you'll show me. So, 
if you hug the left wall up here towards the uh -huh. exit and you have a ranged item, you cannot trigger the end, but you can see the last couple boxes. Oh yeah, look at that. And if you hit the first one, you'll notice we have a vandal bonus before we had the whatever the 8% one is. So that's how you squeeze the extra 2% out of this quest is to uh, make sure you get all the other stuff Brilliant. before you do that. So yeah, it's about 100k a run for the first yeah. run each day. It's not bad. Brilliant. Yay. On to the Divine Crusader. Tide then, I guess. How long does it take you to get from 20 to 28 usually? It depends on how much I'm playing. It can take a couple months. It can take a week, just depending on bonuses and how much I'm playing. Usually I think it's been three or four weeks. Not playing every day. You didn't, Skunk? Oh, I thought everybody knew the boxes. I do have a I YouTube vid. I did not vid. know that either. I just learned something. Oh! Yeah. Heck yeah. If you hit every box up to that point, then the first box at the end there gives you the 10% XP bonus. And the second one's just gravy. In a group, it's worth doing, especially if you have somebody that can just, you know, fireball or something, the optional breakables there by that chest. Mm -hmm. Everything else is easy to hit. That only, the only pain part is that having to jump across that optional chest to get those breakables if you're melee. But if you can do something burst that breaks them all, then you may as well do it and get your extra XP for it. Yeah, I have a YouTube vid, vid up on how to do Spies in the House solo that covers that, as well as the route that I use. Some people do all the valves and get all the different things going, and lower the drawbridge, and there's no point to it. You can just run up there and be done much faster. And it was still 100k XP. Yeah. That was crazy. Oh, there we go. I'm with you. Singing the songs of my people. Oh my gosh, look at that. Because <laughs> dwarf fighters Is that usually because sing. Of the fate singer? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. So that must be like a dwarven drinking song you were just doing. Either drinking or gold. Not sure which. I think it went something like gold, 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 Ow! gold, 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 gold. And then the second verse is gold, 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 gold. I see the difference now. There's one archer down below. Didn't get it still. I hate that dude. <laughs> Doors, of course. Yeah. Do you want me to go get him? Sure. I'll trigger this up here. Gold Schlager, invented by dwarves. Did your game sounds ever come back? I have... Mine are very subtle. Yeah, I think um, I have the Windows setting where if Skype's on, it mutes everything else or yeah. cuts the volume. And I need to fix that at some point, but it's not a big deal. I don't need game sound most of the time anyway.
Are you doing the uh, gather up in meteor? Meteor, everyone. Yeah, that's what I usually do. Take out the casters and then gather everybody else up for some fun times. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. <laughs> Mario time. <laughs> Bad Scottish oh, Titan. I didn't even see Titan there. Oh yeah, this is the part where you throw all the switches and I pike. Ready. Ready to do my part. It's not that bad. That part's done. Yeah. Ah, I bounced. I bounced off the pipe instead of landing on it. Oops. Well, I just I just wanted us to get some more kills, so I dropped down with all these rats. Yeah. That's, you didn't have your rat, I'm, I'm rat hunter you. deed. <laughs> yeah. That's what you it was. You should be thanking me. <laughs> They're all dead. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that's okay. There's more. And these are the annoying ones back here. What's more annoying is jumping and keeping grabbing on these stupid pipes in this area. No, I didn't want the pipe. I wanted to go past that pipe. How'd you get in front of me? Man, you are one fast little dwarf. Yeah. Stubby legs, but much speed. She's a champion. Hello. She's dead champion. And still no chunks. How about you? You do have chunks? No. I haven't oh seen any remnants dropping. Why are there no chunks tonight? The whole point for doing this on hard was to get chunks. Oh, forgot a barrel. Yeah, I don't usually do breakables or slayer in oh, this one. Oh, you don't one. care about that here? Nah. It's not the same. Okay. So what did you do? You just ran through this like a barbarian? Yep. My uh, my guildies on in the PD halls of Valhalla have a have a saying: barbarian doesn't care. He just runs through the traps. <laughs> yep. Well, I have a decent reflex, so usually nothing hits me. <sighs> Jerk! I was trying to hit a lever. Wait, I'm going to heal you. Check it out. Check it out. Don't heal yourself. Ooh. You <laughs> 31,000? Right. <laughs> it was 15,000. I had two 15,000 and a 1,000, I think. Oh. It looked like it was 31,000 total. <laughs> Natural sprinters. <laughs> Wasted on cross country. <laughs> Oh, is this the part where I get electrocuted? Yay, electrocution. Let's go. It's like in Wiz King, never worry about breakables in Wiz King. It's just not worth it. You have to break so many things and take so much time to get. You know, to get conquest, you have to go and hit those uh, the rooms that you fall right into. There. If you fall through the that you fall into, yeah. in order to get conquest, you have to go hit those twice. Yeah, no thanks. Not worth it. There's enough XP for completing the quest, but that extra stuff just isn't worth it. Just in spies, I think the extra 2% is worth it for the 
minimal extra you have to do. You already have to go almost everywhere those barrels are. You may as well just take two seconds and break them. I love doors you don't have to open. You can leave all those idiots behind <laughs> without worrying about them. Wow. the elemental apocalypse yay it's like a play do we have yeah. to stay and watch it no <laughs> awesome i would really rather oh i do want to take this guy out a flying trip it didn't work oh you're down already aren't you I come down too. I was messing around with that blood tie pirate. There he goes. All right. There you are, sorcerer. You. Right, bro. First. Um, I'm gonna be off my headset for a moment. Okay. Mm, he's hitting kind of hard. Yeah, not a problem. Open the doors. While this plot plays out. Yeah, I can't hear my sounds just barely. There we go. Sorry about that. Yep, no problem. Oh, did I ever turn the keyboard back on? I forget. Nope, I didn't. Oh well. When I do that right now, while I have a second break. There we go. Did we get anything for killing the water elementals? It doesn't even matter. Uh, just it, it's annoying to open the chest after if you don't kill them. Okay. Get him out of the way. So we can get the loot. Where do you think you're going, dude? I like getting him trapped in these rooms before he. Uh, disappears for the first time, and then you know where he is. You can keep him trapped in there instead of him not running around everywhere, being annoying. Oh, come on, you're dead. There we go. You have a nice healing amp. 
just laid hands on you for 500. Cool. Let's see, I don't think I have healing amp item on at the moment, so it must be the past life stuff or something. Yeah. Something that gives you good... Whoa, hello. Tarnish Denny Tevi Chain. Okay. I'll take it. Well, those are done. What next? <laughs> Bam! <laughs> Just take comms. Go back to ship. Sell, repair, buff real quick. Can and I then... come to your ship? Yeah. I know when you're there. I'm there. First floor has all the interactables. Repair and shop and all that. and bag. Throw these arrows in the bank. You have anything you particularly feel like doing? Uh, let's see. Uh, about 45 minutes, so let's look um, at the old, ye old compendium. I don't. Uh, <laughs> skunk. I guess I don't have it. I do not have an agenda. Uh, let's here to hang out. do druids then. You can probably beast through that druids pretty quick. Deep? Yep. Nice. Okay, I'm all for it. Make <laughs> it PvP peace fighting. <laughs> Welcome back to watching, Mary.
<laughs> hey, Gemini, how's it going? Since we're time level, we'll just do these on normal. Leave it, dog. You leave my pretzels alone. Good boy. I guess I thought you were closer. I stepped in already. Yeah, I thought I was following you. <laughs> going over to the hospital. Everything is normal. But I'm not going to the hospital first. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, I went to the other one. Wait, you're not doing overgrown? I'll meet you at the hospital here in a second. Oh. I usually do the other one first. Oh. And then go to the hospital. Doesn't you're really just, matter. You're just a saga giver rebel. I rarely complete sagas. Really? <sighs> I still have Mortar Night up. I hate that. Ah! An outbreak. Yeah, go ahead and start it so I don't have to change outbreak, my screen. Outbreak, and we're doing normal, so bam. Much easier. I need to do Mortar by Night again just to get it off the list. Oh, the sword is going to work great in here. Natural main? It, no, it's just ironwood copish. Hmm. But uh, it's got uh, force damage that does really well on the wisps. Ah, yes, that's good, because those wisps are annoying. <laughs> oh, I would like to do more sagas. It's just I don't know a lot of the parts to sagas. Like I don't like giant hold, so I don't do giant hold saga. And then oh, I don't like uh, demon web. So Drew's deep by itself isn't a saga. <laughs> Yay, TR cash inventory management meta game. I still haven't ever TR'd, so I haven't had to deal with the cash thing. After playing on EH, these are so like walking through. <laughs> this is nothing. I mean, we weren't getting chunks anyway, so. Yeah, no, all those quests, not even one. Hurry, trap him, trap him. Yeah, I got him. Being shot out in the back by these wisps. I mean, it's very annoying. We're going to run in a second once he's dead. Oh, I got okay. scared. Well, you can finish him off. I'll yeah. start running. We're good. Whoa, that's a lot of wisps. <laughs> yeah. Oops. If you do the right dialogue, you can come down and just get into the D-door. Huh. And ignore all those. That is pretty awesome. Uh, just make yeah, sure. they're still over there pissed off. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but they can't reach us, so who cares? Uh -huh. 
You ready? Yep. And away we go. Downside is you sometimes get the yellow alert. These guys pop in. Yeah, twink gear is a lot of work. That's why I don't have a lot of it. <laughs> I don't have any ion stones. Actually, I might have one somewhere in the bank somewhere. But I normally don't have any stones or anything to play with. Sit down, Wisp. There we go. That was 3 minutes 40 seconds. That was pretty fast. That was pretty good, and that was 18,000 XP, so I have zero complaints. Yep. <laughs> Should be no problem to get the uh, woads on the next one. I'm worried about farming. I'll farm XP out of the same quest over and over again, but if it's a random item drop, I usually don't want to farm it because it's boring. Even though it's the same thing, running one quest over and over for whatever it is. Yeah. I was just wondering you have to kill the Woodward or yep. kill his friends before he disappears or something like that. Yep. Okay. We shouldn't have a problem, I don't think. Okay. EH, sometimes it's a little tricky to get through them, but and on E, good luck. But at least with my builds. But on normal, it's usually not a big deal. The way these guys are just kind of falling over after a cleave doesn't really worry me. I see that's not bad. One item of life you farm for and that way over your lives you'll finally have your all your gear. I can see that. Sweet. That was worth quite a bit of XP. Let's do that again. Two more times. Yeah. An extra chest for it, too. Oh, didn't glitch this time. I always have fun with these glitches. <laughs> that's, uh, that's funny, Gemini. Uh. <laughs> I'm sorry, nobody. Lessa, but that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is my brand new Tadidio. It's my first day in the game. Right. You have a level 28. First I day. Just, I was going through t shirts this afternoon, uh, trying to figure out if I should throw stuff away. And uh, I have almost every single t shirt that Turbine has ever put out. Huh. The DDO ones, not the Lotro ones. I only have one of the Lotro ones. That's cool. I have zero, although yesterday I was wearing my red box Dungeons and Dragons shirt. Here, Mr. Woodwode. Kill him, boy. Get over here. There, there he go. is. He's being a little reluctant. He knows his days are numbered. He 
his seconds were numbered, I think. Draculetta uh, says he wants a t-shirt. Ah! Was I supposed to fall down there? Good. <laughs> come on, come on, we don't have all day. Open this up. Come on, dude. Here, if I sing you a song, will you go faster? <laughs> da, 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 da. Come on, go. It's blowing up my phone. Oh. You can always watch the replays, Gemini. I. I don't usually watch it live either. Ah, the damsels of DDO. Yeah, that's right. That's me. Are you guys on tonight? Uh, no, this is an off week for us. Okay. So it was a perfect time for me to come and uh, hang cool. out on your show. I never know. I lose track of when y'all are on or off. All right. So about this extra chest. This is back there in the by the oh. shrine. Right, we got it already. Yep. <laughs> As a matter of fact, Draculetta is going to be on the damsels this coming week. We're doing a wolf pack. Cool. And he rolled he rolled a a druid warlock hmm. for us, so that. Because the uh, the rules is if you run with a wolf pack, you have to be a wolf. So right. He, he I I took him. I was with him in the desert when he was testing it out, and I saw him shooting fireballs out of his mouth, and it was really cool. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I should probably take my level. I didn't even realize I had one. Oh, yeah. You do that real quick. It's just right down here. True enough, Gemini. I like seeing what other people's streams are about. And if I can't catch them live, though, it's nice to have the option to do the archive. Say, so, okay, now I see what that's about. Let's see what they're doing. How they do their stuff. Ooh, boring level. Do we have time to go to the Thorn and Paw? Oh, yeah. Awesome. I'm there already. I think it's this one. Yeah, Thorn and Paw. We have time for both of them still. They're quick. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not saying you have to. I'm just saying you know, it's, it's always an option to you know see people, see what they're doing. Everybody does things a little differently. And it's fun. And if you know you're not going to be up past midnight, so you're not going to catch it live ever, it's an option. And... When your other show with Samus is when? Oh, DDO Cocktail Hour. We do Friday. That's Friday at 1230. Yeah. 1230 Central Time. Um, and that's noon. 1230, not midnight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, not midnight. <laughs> so there's another place yeah. Jim and I could catch you. Yeah. That's with Samus. But that's on his channel, uh, uh, Twitch Samus Grobo. And that's very adult-oriented. 
it's not... Um, you have to be really careful about that. I have a couple of guildies in Sublime here on Thelanus that are deeply religious gentlemen, very nice guys, do not like swearing or anything, any kind of talk that's uh, not very PC. So, right. Um, uh, the cocktail hour is just not like that. <laughs> it yeah. is very inappropriate. <laughs> yep. So you're going to each node and destroying it. Yep. And then taking off and the stuff rubber bands. Yep. Okay. It all leashes back. Whoops. Went the wrong way. It's just much faster. I mean if you want the extra XP you can kill the druids, but I don't think it's worth it. I have been actually killing the druids when you leave and then I follow you. <laughs> You can get it down to pretty fast if you don't do that and just get the nodes that you have to, get the guys you have to to open the root walls and call it good. You can also skip the dire bears there in that big room. Huh. Oops, I missed somebody. There it goes. We may have had times for something else after the other druid one. We may be able to do don't drink the water. We'll see what we're times at. Mm. I'm gonna kill a druid. Oh, yeah. And then I'll just follow you out. Can't break with tradition now, I've done it every time. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. So when we come around the corner by the shrines, you can ignore the dire bear and just jump this pick, the spike pit. Okay. When you turn the corner there, and uh, yeah, he won't follow you because a uh, spike pit. <gasps> oh, right! I've I've found the spike pit for you. All right. <laughs> That's what Titan does every time. Uh, yep. Catches that spike pit. Right over the edge. There we are. I still understand how that last corruption node gets destroyed from way over here. I don't usually like to let it out because it lets the other dire bears out. Or, and I'd rather get these, get the mama bear down first before doing the others. Not that it really matters on normal. Harder difficulties, it does matter. And then just trigger the end and get the chest. Do, do, do. Yay. Some. So five minutes, seven seconds could be slightly 49K. faster. 49k. Could have done it slightly faster. Unbelievable. Slightly faster. Yeah. <laughs> That's not my best time. <laughs> it's not. Sub five. Can do sub five. I watch a lot of speedrunning streams, so. Wow. Yeah. Nuts. Like I said, there was plenty of time to get through these. <laughs> Half hour to get through two quests? Come on. We'll try for three. See if we can get all three with uh, don't drink the water included. Yeah, we should be able to do that. I'm talking to my saga giver to make sure that I can get my end reward at the finish of it, because, you know. Oh, this is the one where you have to become bear fish in uh, something or other. Uh, wolf, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excuse me. 
Oh, there is a wisp. Wisp can usually. Oh, druid. Druid. There you go. Stupid druid. He evaded my trip. You have to kill these guys unless they come into the bear fight. Just run right by them. Okay. What about that lady there? She's the one you have to fight. I think she's a hag, right? Where she's she? a bear. Oh, she's a bear. See? She's a bear. There she is. Yep. You have to go over and knock the roots to trigger her bear switch and then oh, kill the bear to okay. open them. But you notice the other guys went back and they're not doing anything, so we can ignore them safely, okay. not waste the time. Now for underwater action. And I'm skipping the optionals, just going directly to the next part. Okay. You can get the optional chest and you can get the chest by the drow and kill them and all that stuff, but it's a lot of time for not really much gain. Hey, dog, I see you. Give me another half hour, buddy. We'll take you out, okay? Relax. Lay down. Hey. Lay down. And the wisps here. And he's no longer there. That wisp just pops up when once you're out of the water. Uh, Sometimes he's annoying. And here's another place to run run through the bear traps. Sometimes the bears actually get caught in the bear traps, which is funny. Oh, that's awesome. They did. They're back there struggling. Finally, a trap that does... What it says on the tin. Works. Yeah, what it says, <laughs> what it's supposed to do. Let's see if this was here. Yep, he's here. No, no, don't go running anywhere. Stay here and die. The trick to this part is figuring out what does and doesn't count as the guys who block you killing the root wall. Oh, yeah. See, each root wall has a different set of things that determines whether you can get through it or not. And there's his buddy. Yep. Skitter. I have a pet spider, too. See? His name is Helmut. I named him after the Ataraxia named spider. Hmm. Even though that one's name is Helgut. It just looked way too too close to me. Yeah. <laughs> so I renamed him. There's a shrine there if you really want it, but this is the boss. So. Yeah, nah, I don't need it. Cat. It's been super easy. Oh boy. Uh, but I'm gonna be off headset because um, okay. I'm getting a call from my kiddo. Sure. That's the way, dog. Just grab your bone. Cat, get down. Why don't you block in the exhaust ports on my laptop? That'd be bad. But it's warm. Sorry about that. Cool. No I have problem. to do this battle fast because uh, my son is freaking out. He needs help with the dog. Okay. He got um, cut today. Mm. My dog got neutered, and so 
yeah. wearing the cone of shame and <laughs> kind of out of it. So. Yeah. We're done. Oh, yay. Awesome. Come on, chest appear. Well, I'm going to go ahead and uh, help him okay. uh, as soon as we finish out from here. Thank you for having me. Oh, I got yep. the swailing blade. It was fun. Uh, Hello, dog. Yep, 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 yep. All right, that other side can stay there. I got to go. Bye. Bye. So that was special guest Lessa, and as we said, she's available on Damsels, which are not on tonight. The uh, DDO cast, the whatever that Friday thing is called, I forget what she said it was called, but plenty of places to see Lessa if you want to see more. And all of that, I am going to take a break here, walk the dog, stretch a bit, maybe get a snack. And then I'll probably continue with, uh, don't drink the water here. So this is Seymour on DDO's stream. Thanks for watching. Do appreciate it. Cocktail hour, that's it. DDO cocktail hour. Coactail, cocktail, whichever. It's close enough. So yes, I do appreciate everybody watching. I will be back in probably 10-ish minutes. So you know, feel free to stand up, take a break, do some inventory management, whatever you need to do, and uh, we'll be back soon. Thanks for watching.
Hi, Moosey. And I'm getting back here. Get a mild cord tangle fixed. There we go. All right. <laughs> Cormaco bear. Sorry, didn't mean to say WALK -okay and get your dogs moving. But the dog has been su successfully emulated, and uh, yeah. Back to questing. I think it gets again to Lessa for guest starring. After a surprisingly long climb down the well, you find yourself in a cavernous expanse. You can see that the well water is fed by a fetid underground stream. Moosey, Monk, Mist, Mari, Boat, any y'all, Gemini, any y'all want to guess start us? Maybe I'll work something out. The source of the poison water lies above and beyond this waterfall. You will need to find a way up in order to follow it. The cabin ahead looks different. You must be close to the surface once again. A Yuan Ti priestess has raised a magical barrier. Preventing you from passing further. You on T appear. I probably need to start grouping with people more that do those quests that I don't do very often just to learn them. Yeah, exactly. That's the same as my dog. He's all wants to go out and then open the door. Oh heck no, I ain't going out there. What are you crazy? It's raining. It's hilarious. He'll go out on the step and then turn right back around and dart back inside. Are you crazy? I don't want to be out here. Yeah. It's so funny. He still hasn't figured out the whole, I have a big golf umbrella and if you stay next to me then you don't get rained on as much. He still hasn't figured that out yet. It's kind of funny. So he's running out away from the umbrella then shaking off. Oh god, I'm getting wet. Well, if you'd stay next to me like you're supposed to, wouldn't have that problem. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Who put this rain here? I didn't order rain. Why would you do that to me? You don't love me, do you? Make me get wet just to go to the bathroom. Yeah. Drama dog. Yeah, I'm talking about you. So, on the way back in, I accidentally caught a cat with the door. He seems to be okay, but he was sitting by the... There's a We have one of those uh, please break me in to break into the house windows right next to the door. And uh, he was sitting there looking out, and evidently he didn't see us coming or something. I don't know. He took too long to get away from that, and I didn't see him in the window, so I opened the door and kind of smooshed him a little bit between the bench in the door. He seems to be okay though. I checked him out a little bit. Alright Gemini, see ya. Yeah, we can figure something out. Whether I have something, I mean I've got, you know, Iconics if nothing else I could use on other servers and stuff. Probably see you on your stream later Gemini, thanks for stopping by. See ya. You find yet another Yuan T barrier. You must be on the right track. It's like drow and uh, houses and uh, the demon web and storm horns. The stuff, things I don't usually do very often. It'd be nice to get groups of people and do that. And of course, do the raids that I still need to do that I haven't done yet. That would also be nice. 
Do those last bits a favor. Cool, skunk. What you got here on Telian? An acrid, sickly scent assails you. Oh, I'm already here. Wow. Just sort of cruising along, didn't realize I was already here. That must be the source of the Yuan-Ti's poison. I should probably buff up. The little ones promised wealth, but this said nothing of sending meals. <laughs> you just made him, you didn't pay attention. What was where? That's cool. Well, let me know at some point, we'll figure something out. Understand. Let me figure out what I'm doing, Titan. We'll see. If I can get out of here, stupid acid over time junk. I think I'm going to go do House P stuff, and then go over to House K. I have a little 15 PDK in every server, and that's about all I know. I know I've got some other stuff around here and there, but nothing really memorable. Probably should repair and sell and all that. I haven't done that in a while. So well. I said house P, so let's do house P. Do party crashers first.
We'll let you take care of the dragon marks that you've got ranged. The air in the illusion area is different than outside. As if you were transport with a mark's enchantment shattered, the illusions around you dissipate. The way deeper into the illusion area is open. The air suddenly shifts from tropical heat to bitter cold. It is as if you were teleported leagues away, rather than just having left a few feet. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. And doing that crafting makes me glad that I do a lot of collectibles. I have big stocks of all the different collectibles, at least all the common ones. It's a lot easier to just rip through crafting levels than have to go, oh man, I'm out of these. Probably do some deconstructing again at some point. Now that we have the crafting hole on the ship, it'll be easier to do that. A little bit of lag there. The Mark of Shadow created copies of itself. They must be illusions. Only destroying the real one will end this death trap. That must have been a real mark. The illusionary one, unlike the previous room, this place feels like it's that scorpion completely enveloped the mark of shadow. You will need to destroy it in order to get the mark. of this make-believe scorpion has also extinguished the mark of shadow. The illusionary barrier is gone. This quest is so good. Illusions of illusions. Such a fun stuff to do. Titan, do you have knock? Okay. I was slightly worried earlier because I had a uh, video card driver update. I wasn't sure. Sometimes that can be flaky, but it seems to be holding up pretty well so far. Oh, look, Titan spiking. you would let me stand up and kill you, we would have this problem. Continuing to knock me down. That's cool. If you want to join, join. Santella Shlana. I'm 25 at the moment. So I think Titan says he was 24. Just doing some epic XP grinding. I think I've got... i got several in the... Uh, like... 7 to 14 range. I've got a level 2. Started a brand new Warlock in our All Warlock group last Thursday and we... Ran up to level five. The Fialan chapter house must have been closed as a precaution. Pretty quickly. 
It's only a couple hours. And it seems rather next to the security gates. But things die really fast when everybody's a warlock and pew pewing everything. You would not be able to destroy it as you did with the marks in the illusion area. The Chapter House Theater normally hosts stage plays for Fialan's elite patrons. It looks like its shows are on hold during the Grand Gala. Get through the stuff and the things. Oh, I forgot to switch my goggles back. The illusions in this display hall don't appear to be interactive. Like At least I know it before too much time had passed. They probably won't attack you. Hopefully. Not even a whole quest. I usually recognize that at the end of the night. Like, oh, for the past ten quests I've run, I forgot to do that. You finally reach the house That's cool. of Marlin Grand Gala. Now to find the guest list and add Cyan's name. Different time, different quests. Cool. What am I doing? Going up the stairs while Titan does the guest list. That's what I'm doing. And I got some DCs going on Titan, that sucks. Random DCs suck. Reminds me, how's the stream doing tonight? I didn't. I haven't really been paying attention with. Uh... Oh, good. Zero drop frames. It's doing well. Now we just wait for Contessa Cyan to walk. What do you want, Cap? What do you want, Cap? You've already been fed, you're not getting any more food. I know that's what you're rubbing up to me for, because you want food again, don't you? Don't you? Oh. How's the dragon doing? Nope, he's huddling back there in the corner. Hard to see. You did do the thing. Yeah, there she is. She's taking forever. Sometimes it gets bugged right there and she never comes out. It's annoying. Yep. I love that there's no combat ending, but we're not going to do that. It takes too long without knock. It's not really worth it. <sighs> Whew. I don't usually get allergies. Sometimes something bothers me like I have allergies. Come on, Contessa, walk faster. So I might actually go farm some Sharn stuff to get the BTA gear to craft into stuff and all that. We'll see. I'm thinking about it now that I'm within striking distance of the max. 
usable stuff. Particular things like Master's Gift. I did my Warlock's gear, but my Arcane Archer could use some gear too. Oh, I don't know. Here we go. Oh, my stomach. Do buffs actually work on Cyan? I don't know. If they do, she just got some extra stuff. Yes, I love when he runs up by himself. It's so much easier to take him down. Especially when he's targeting somebody else. Why are you kiting him? Just kill him. There's those other casters. There they are. Get them XP's. On to the snitch. Uh, don't forget to get my thing. Do that sometimes. Forget to pick this up. The sounds and smells of the busy tavern drift in from the next room. Perhaps Roderick Nettle won't cause a scene if you ask him a few discreet questions in a public place. Let me go, let me go, let me go. The stench of smoke walks down the corridor. <sighs> that ledge and ladder sometimes just troll, troll, troll. Troll, troll, troll. Oh, got a text. Check that out. Hmm. That's not fun. Mom's having some medical issues. Eh, whatever, already in. Shit, an EH, but oh well. care that much. 
Ah. Got caught. Swam. If you could lower one of the nearby ladders, you would be able to climb up onto the rooftops. As you turn the valve, yeah, we should have a K after this. And angry squeals nearby. I've got one of these on while we're waiting for him to be. Oh, does he trigger when we're both here? Probably. I'll wait. On Roderick, get you and Kratos up here. Now, dog, why did you just drop your bone? That was a dumb thing to do. Well, I know the coffee table's in the way. Why did you drop your bone under it? Are you getting it? Might as well kill this stuff already. Anytime yeah, you want to trigger and let us kill you, that's cool. I missed my concentrated ground. Ah, and I seriously just did that. Oh well. Go ahead and kill the hellhounds. I'll be back up. I have to eat something soon. I kind of didn't have lunch, or I had dinner for lunch, or something. It was weird. As you open the valve, the muffled sound of gears turning can be heard from the wall. Get of over there.
Your pursuit has led you out of Tanner's Alley and into a quieter, more... Watchdogs dream peacefully in the sunshine below. If you're careful, you can... Sneaking never works here, but let's try it again just for fun. Dogs lie. Oh, it worked. I actually snuck by the dogs. Woot! Now, does that optional happen when I trigger the lever here, or what? A magical field flickers into place, protecting the upper courtyard from unwanted intruders. The top way is open, so you have to bother the dogs. Well, come here. Come here, dog. Hi. Hi, dog. How are you? How's my dog? How's the dog? How's the dog? Leave my pretzels alone. Lay down, relax. Watch me play DDO. Can you do that for me? For a little while more? top way was open, but okay. It's always nice to sit here where the caster's going to spawn and take them out first. Now wait for the plot to happen. Plot. I reminds me I need to update my uh, DDO page to have my warlock on it. I guess I could have song, but oh well. I don't really care. seal. It wasn't the right seal, though. Gah! It's annoying. The seal of utility vest, not the EGA. Or AGA, I mean. EAGA. Whatever. Darn it! Uh, Von 3.
Blackheart trolls have made their home in the shadow of the forest. They seem eager to repel the allies of Vale. <laughs> Come on, scorpions, come get some. Level 25 XP bar just isn't moving very fast. Speaking of which, I got an email earlier that the Humble Bundle has a Borderlands bundle on. Up now. A whole lot of Borderlands for not much money. I like Borderlands, they're fun games.
So what is everybody's favorite crafted twink gear for their stuff? Sit down, bard. I'm telling you to sit down, you're not obey. What's that about? Get the key. Yeah. I mean, Kenneth crafting twink gear for your low level. I did a uh, unbalancing of invulnerability, I think. Armor. Um, I did screaming of bleed weapon. You've entered a new section of the caves. In the distance, I want to do dusk feather fall, but uh, I'm having a hard time with the purified or whatever. The, Dusk needs it's purified, isn't it? The dusk needs. I need to figure that out. That whole getting the purified th dragon shards for crafting thing. I haven't figured that out yet. So like you can get them from tomes somewhere or dragon shards somewhere, something somewhere. Just haven't figured that out. Nope. Nope. There's one. He's not up here. Is that all three then? Nope, there's the other one. That's three. If I manage to not screw this up this time. After a bunch of perfect runs here, then all of a sudden I started screwing this up. He saved against my trip. What a jerk. Yeah, I went true neutral, so I'm looking forward to superior stability. I was hoping to fit it along with invulnerability or something. Just haven't figured out where to put it yet. Made a mistake on my screaming of bleed weapon, and it's too high level. It's only level six instead of level five. It's not a big deal. Yeah, it seems like a pretty sweet thing to have. Is it just me, or the, are the shards not really well labeled? Like, some of the shards were just blank shards. They didn't have, they didn't tell you what it did, and the flexible shards don't say flexible on them necessarily. That's what I was thinking, I was seeing. It's really a big pain to try to figure out what the heck you're doing when. Oh, I have a shard of this, but it's not letting me do it. Why is it not let me do this? I don't understand. Hmm. I think I have the acid lore on something. Oh, it's the rock boots. That's what I have acid lore on in my... Watch my jigger. Sorcerer.
Let's do this, Marut. Oh yeah. Rain, sonic damage, just fire. He's tearing through this dude. Alright. Um Fallen One. Since we're right here. Flaming gray sort of metaline. Yvonne one. This looks like the underground highway to Farask Arena. If you search for Dirge's contact, keep your guard up. The spectators may not be friendly. I want the extra XP's this time. It shouldn't take long to, long to kill these guys. It's not much ex extra XP, but it is extra XP. This is an intimidate check, isn't it? Yeah. I was hoping I'd be able to kill him anyway. I just want to get these done quickly. I don't really care about doing EH this time. The gates of Farask Arena loom ahead, guarded by a well-groomed bugbear and a host of trollish enforcers. Maybe do Wiz King after that. Lord Favor on three spies. Yeah, the crafting is almost too flexible. I was sort of paralyzed by the decisions. Like, oh wow, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. All sorts of stuff. What I'd like to see in a crafting app is that as you select stuff, you can put a minimum level that you want it to meet, and then it would just filter out anything that would take it above that minimum level a bit faster. So for level 5, you can get one good thing on the, most of the items. That's about it. You can't do too much else. In a lot of cases you can get like on Weapons, you can get two things and maybe plus one if you're lucky, but probably not much more than that. The lower levels. I looked at some threads, and LSD 37 has a good one on weapons and what weapons break different DRs and how to craft them as you go so you end up with a good weapon by the end and stuff.
Yeah, I've got a bunch of gear with augment slots, but I realized that it wasn't my best choice for crafting level 5 stuff because I uh, pushed them in level up and I wanted other things on them instead of the augment stuff. So, plus I don't have a whole lot of augments sitting around that are low level. Once you get up into the tens, it'll probably be easier to use that stuff. Well, if you stand up, Shaw, you can actually hit things. You notice words etched above this gate. Ready room. So once I get there, I'll have some stuff to use, and I've got some uh, weapon blanks of various metal types, so I've got those two to play with. Unfortunately, it's not necessarily what I want in the kind of weapon type I want. Oh, that dude's still up here. Since I was trying the melee warlock thing, I was I really wanted that invulnerability. I couldn't fit um, life shield on it and still have it be level five, but unbalancing worked. So you know that's good. That'll be fine. Better than whatever random loot gen junk I was using before, anyway. Yeah, Titan DC'd again. He's having something, some issue with DC'ing, so. Not entirely surprising. Although, you know, I really should remember something against uh, fear. These stupid kobold shamans. I did this. I might as well shield as well. Come on, guys. Get up here. We're here to fetch you. No, there you are. Jerk arrow until slowing me. Slow me down, man. Who could imagine such a disaster? So many great gladiators slaughtered in their prime. Keep forgetting to sing. It's time for an all out showdown. From all four teams have armed themselves for battle. See, I, when I respect Shaw last time, I did all strength, all con. And I dumped everything else pretty much, letting my tomes take care of it. And so far, it's been working pretty well. I've noticed a little bit of difference here and there. having more hit points and hitting harder. I've missed that I had to dump points into helping my reflex save a little more than usual. No UMD to speak of. You know, there's trade-offs, but I'm liking it. Oh, did somebody get stuck? 
Somebody got stuck. Who got stuck? There he is. Well, Titan might be coming back. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, he uh, got his butt beat now. After unbeaten. I think when Titan DC'd, the scaling went back down because that seemed awful easy. Awfully easy. Go get this optional. Jerk, he kill you so you don't interrupt me up in my chest. My loot. These guys are paper, just dying so easily. Sure, whatever. Give him one more minute. I know it's annoying to DC and try to get back and not get back in time, but I am streaming and I need to get keep moving, keep the action going. Something interesting happening. No one wants to watch a boring stream with nothing happening. Hmm. Fleshmakers EE. -E. Marker deaths up. Or Corthos, Coin Lord Fair runs. No, thank you. See the XP on this quest anyway. Not worth it. Not really. Nothing I really want to do. Oh, there is Wiz King in it. Yeah. I actually may call it here. Yeah, I believe I'm going to call it here. It's been about three hours. Had special guest Lessa. Had Titan. Did some soloing. Got a level. Really get, didn't get anything to speak of in the way of loot. Put some XP's and all that. The only other thing I would think of doing is Devil Assault, and I really don't feel like spending a half hour doing that. So, 
thank you everybody for watching. This is C Morgu. This has been Twitchy Tuesdays. Most weeks Tuesdays at this time. I'm doing the streaming thing. DDO. Also streaming on my own channel. Archive my streams up on YouTube. I know Cordovan does as well, so you can see it on Twitch. Hi highlights and replays, you can see it. On YouTube, the DDO official channels, YouTube, you see it on my YouTube, wherever you watch it. Thank you. Appreciate it. And again, if you want to run with me, um, I'm on Thelonis most of the time. Arrangements can be made for other servers. Just let me know. We'll have more special guests and do more fun things. And uh, yeah, I'll pass you over to Gemini. If you aren't already following Gemini, you should. He does do a lot of DDO streaming. He's probably the most reliable in that most weeknights he is streaming DDO. Um, so keep that in mind. You can see him here at Twitch TV Gemini 166. And uh, yeah, have a good evening, everybody, and see you next week, if not before.